26 million people can't be wrong. What is it about this crazy game that keeps them coming back again and again? One glance at the homestead, one of Lakewood's two public golf courses, and you'll see why everyone loves the scenery. Here you'll find Rocky Mountain views to the west and Queen City panoramas to the east. And in the middle, there's a really great golf course. The part I like is the friendliness of the people that operate it and the maintenance of the course. It's just beautiful. I love Homestead because it has a lot of fun rolling hills and when you're up at the way at the top it has a beautiful view of the city. This is probably one of the uh, best courses to come to if you're looking for players assistants who are good guys. The people in the office are great. The restaurant's good. What more can you ask for? The city of Lakewood asked for a lot when it began planning the homestead and nearby Fox Hollow golf courses. Lakewood wanted a championship golf course that was closer to an executive course in size. The city wanted superb facilities that included a nicely designed clubhouse, exceptional golf pros who were available to teach and inspire any level of player, a top-notch driving range and chipping range with six target greens, and a full-service restaurant open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I think the uniqueness in Homestead is the fact that it is a championship quality golf course without the lane. You feel like you're on a, a regulation course. The way the, the holes are spread out, the difficulty of the holes, uh, believe me, it'll test every facet of your game. You'll use every club in your bag and you'll have a, a wonderful experience when you're done. Lakewood also wanted a golf course that was known not only for natural beauty, but as a place where the wild things are. In many ways, we, we're stewards of the land. Both courses are Audubon uh, certified, and as such, it's pretty a, a rigorous program. The fact that it's not developed with houses or commercial really lends itself to wildlife. The homestead was designed by architect Dennis Griffiths to be more of a traditional golf course. It's a link style course, so when you do play the course, uh, a term we use is it's, it's very much a sanctuary. And as such, you won't have development and houses around. And, when you're playing a golf course, it's very much a natural setting and you really feel one, one with nature, but you're playing golf. At a par 65, the homestead demands shot making. If you play the course from the front tees, you've got a range of 3,500 yards. If you play it from the back tees, you're playing 5,100 yards. And the holes are extraordinary for a link style course. Holes 11 through 17 um, are kind of in a recessed bowl area, which was an old mine site back in the uh, I want to say the 50s, 40s and 50s. And so it's bold and caved out in those holes. And as such, it's really unique in terms of the setting. People love this golf course and their favorite hole. On the uh, Homestead Golf Course, I feel the marquee hole is number 17. And the teeing ground is from a plateau setting. There's a large canyon in between that and the green, the tee and the green. And that green is kind of on a plateau setting as well. Plays anywhere from 150 to a uh, 183, 185 yards, so it can really pose a challenge, especially if the wind's blowing. And when that shot is up in the air, you're just hoping and praying that you pick the right club. It goes over that That's big, great. it's always a challenge, yeah. and if you get over it, it's pretty exciting to hit mm -hmm. the green on the other side. Yeah. Number 17, when you stand up there and you can look across the foothills, you can look across the city skyline, you can look across the, this beautiful setting, it's just a hard to beat a day that you can get out and do that kind of thing. No matter what hole you're playing, the golf course was designed to be accessible to every player, even those with physical disabilities. We do have a, uh, a handicapped cart, and it was designed so that, that uh, people with uh, physical disabilities can play golf uh, and not be hindered by curbs on the cart path or deep bunkers. And with two teaching professionals at the homestead, anyone can learn to take their game to the next level. The game of golf is, is it's a great game plain and simple. I, I'm not a very good golfer, but I love the game and the beauty of it, you can play it all your life. It's social if you want it to be. It can be competitive if you want. The Homestead offers league play for regulars who can't get enough of the game. Just check with the friendly staff to sign up for men's, women's, couples, or senior leagues. We actually just commented on the gentleman, I forget his name, but he, when he checks us in, he's always so pleasant and so nice and helpful and encouraging because we're not that good. <laughs> so he's always like, go out and have fun, you can do it. So we really appreciate their, their, their nice yeah, attitude. So. Nice. And the food's great too. I'm from the East Coast, so when I have company come, I like to bring them here. They get a real taste of the West. And uh, the people here are great. We play a lot of golf, we play every weekend. It's really green. 
They take real good care of the greens and the fairways, and we enjoy it. Both of us have kids, so we're getting away from our kids, and we both love to golf. Discover how close to the countryside you really are. Get out to the homestead for a round of golf, a delicious meal, a glorious view, or even a hike or bike ride on one of the surrounding trails. Make the homestead your home away from home for great fun and some of the best golf in the West. The quality of the golf course, the condition, the nature of the people that work there, it, it really gives you a wonderful experience.